Hey guys, so it is April 1st, but there is no fooling that there's a lot of great things going on at Bookworks this month. So we're talking with Amanda Sutton. Amanda, good to see Hello, you. Nice so you, what's going on at Bookworks this month? Well, this is the perfect April Fool's Day event. Okay. This book, The Last Unicorn. William Dubuise is a, uh, an environmentalist who's worked for the Nature Conservancy and lots of other groups. He's based out of Santa Fe. This book is about um, him and some other scientists discovering a what they thought was a last unicorn. Oh, it's wow. actually a, a, a beautiful horned animal that lives in the Laos jungles um, called a seola. Mm -hmm. And so this is a, uh, a document of their journeys there in Laos and finding this um, one of the first and the largest mammal species found in 50 years. No kidding. So quite a scientific discovery. April is also National Poetry Month. So we're doing a lot with poetry as we normally do. Mm -hmm. um, our first event in April featuring poetry is Tucson poet Logan Phillips. Okay. This book is published by Weston Press, which is a local poetry press. Logan will be here Saturday, April 4th, and he'll also be at Tractor Brewing that night uh, doing some poetry with other West End poets mm -hmm. and spinning some music. He's a DJ no and kidding. he does some really great cumbias. So if you guys want to come out and dance, this would be a great opportunity to do so, Saturday, April 4th. April 3rd, we're hosting Amy Fusselman. Her book is called Savage Park. This is about um, parenting and allowing children to explore risk taking in their play and how that actually makes kids safer and better able to kind of handle physical challenges right. than, than over parenting. She visited a park in Hong Kong where kids were doing all kinds of crazy things, using hammers and nails and starting fires. And she was really taken aback by this and went back to New York and sort of thought about how we parent here in the U.S. and how something like that would be so shocking to people here. Right. Clearly, I need to read that book. <laughs> yeah. I'm very interested in that one as well. Um, our big event this month, we're so excited about, Alexander McCall Smith, mm -hmm. a Scottish mystery writer. We're hosting him in conjunction with the ABC Libraries, so we're able to host him at the Chemo for a free event. Um, going through the signing line will require purchase from Bookworks, okay. but this is going to be great fun. Um, he's just a really fun Scottish guy. He was a doctor who started writing in his 50s, and he's now put out something like 50 books in the last 15 to 20 no years. Wow. New York Times bestseller. Most of these take place in Africa. He has an African protagonist, a, a woman detective, uh, the number one ladies detective agency. Wow. So okay. this will be a really fun event. He has a new book out called Emma, which is a modern retelling of the Jane Austen story. But wow, we will have cool. all of his mystery series available that night. Great. And last but not least? Last but not least, Mark of the Thief is historical fiction for teens. We always like to highlight a children or a teen book here at Bookworks. We do a lot of events for kids as well. Um, Jennifer Nielsen is from Albuquerque and this one takes place in ancient Rome. So her protagonist Nick must save the Roman Empire. Um, lots of drama, lots of action. So just encourage the young people to come out to her event yeah. as well. This one takes place April 7th. April 7th. Yes. So as you can see guys, lots of stuff coming up here at the very beginning of April. For all the information and all the details happening here at Bookworks, head over to casa.com.